hey guys welcome to my channel or should i say welcome back if it's your first time here i'm kels and i do natural hair tutorials and explore hair growth remedies if this is something you're interested please do consider subscribing to my channel and if you're a long time subby welcome back fam so in today's video i'll be sharing with you seven oils that i have actually used and tested and it is also known to stimulate and provide massive hair growth also i'll be using a bonus hair fertilizer in this ingredient today so let me just tell you guys a little about each product so the first item is the jamaican castor oil and it is known to moisturize thicken, strengthen and replenish the hair it increases hair growth it stimulates blood flow to the scalp thus supplying nutrients to the hair follicles now the olive oil contains proteins antioxidants agents that contribute to hair growth and over time strengthens the hair follicles the next item is jojoba oil and it prevents hair breakage and strengthens your hair it is also helpful in treating dandruff dry scalp and itchy scalp almond oil is rich in vitamin b7 biotin it helps protect your hair from sun damage and has a natural spf 5. now these three ingredients here are some diy ingredients you can check them out on my channel where i made them this one is the aloe vera oil and aloe vera oil is very beneficial to the hair you can check out the video on that then i'm just going to add a few lemongrass to it lemongrass has its own caribbean secret and not last but not even least is merengue oil and i made this a couple of days ago and it was soaking in this container for actually this video so um the bonus item as we all know is the virgin hair fertilizer and i actually saw a lot of persons on youtube using it and i decided to buy it and it has been working wonders with my hair i did not actually think my hair could grow this much but it really assisted in my hair growth process journey okay guys so let's just start off by grabbing your container and i'm just going to mix all the ingredients together i'm just going to start off with the store-bought ingredients and then i'm just going to head right into the ingredients that i made at home so just continue to watch this
oil um, on the right or left whichever way you're viewing this I'm just showing you guys how I actually prepared my Morage oil I have a video where I actually got these these um, naturally from off the tree and I blended them to make this so I'm just gonna add a couple of oils to it just so that you can saturate and blend them together so if you want to check out that video I can link it down in the description and also I can put the video in the thumbnail right out at the top so what I am doing in the other video is that I'm just grabbing a cloth and just straining the ingredient because I do not want the you know the what did you say leaf particles I don't want the particles in my oils so I'm just straining with a random cloth that I found you can use a cheesecloth or you know a stocking cap or anything that you can find that is easy to strain it so that you don't have the particles I'm just mixing all these ingredients together and just combining them now I'm just going to cover my container and I'm just going to move along to the hair fertilizer now the hair fertilizer has a thick consistency it's not really that much oil based unless it's heated up so I'm just going to grab a container and do like a double boiler method so that I can you know get this to a liquid form get the virgin hair fertilizer to a liquid form once this is in a liquid form what I'm going to do I'm just going to um, transfer it to the other container and then just mix them all together combining yeah. 